Okay, back on Flammy. All healed and saved. Leveled up uh, the weapons that I could. Where is the floating thing? Oh well. We'll get back to that later. Right now, we need to land back on the Mana Fortress and you land right on it though. Uh, it can be a little tough. And it looks like things have changed yet again. Everything has sunk. Uh, we need to talk to Gemma. Gemma, what is up? Uh, actually, first let's take a look at everything that I leveled up. We now have the Dragon Lance, uh, the upgrade uh, spear. Uh, the, the whip has upgraded to the Nimbus Chain. The bow is the same, I think. Uh, as is the uh, boomerang, still on the frizz bar. Uh, the, the javelin has upgraded to the elf's harpoon. Uh, still nothing on the gloves, there's still the hyperfist with the claws. And now we have the gigas sword, which is better than the masamune and the excalibur because of, I don't know, gigas! Let's talk to Jenna now. How you doing, buddy? Jake, you okay? You, we barely got away. We failed to stop the fortress's revival. The Mana Beast will appear and crash against the fortress any minute. It'll cause the destruction of this world, but we mustn't give up yet. Sage Jock has spoken of the Mana Tree in Pure Land at the world's end. Usually it's hidden under a dense cloud barrier, but the fortress is consuming the last of the world's mana, and the barrier has surely weakened. You just might be able to land there. The seeds that have powered up your sword are a small part of the Mana Tree. Find the tree itself, and you could instantly revive the Mana Sword. We have no choice. We must find that place. Yeah, the, the characters are all nodding to me. You have to find that place. O okay, game. Okay, I'll do it. It's a forbidden place. No one's been there. Beware. Charlie, things will work out well once I get there. Thanatos' bunch double-cross the Emperor. What are they up to? I don't know. I don't know. Some of my men are inside. They're dead. Now, if I remember correctly, there should be one other person here. Kind of an important person. Where the hell is she? Like, seriously. Where is she? <laughs> she needs to be around here. Hey, Nico is here, though. That is important. I was looking for... Sergo, it's my friend from the sh sand ship. I, I was not looking for you. Yosin suddenly calmed down, grown calm, and Maria's had a complete change of heart. Maria, boy's name, because uh, we do need to head to Nico. Nico here has the best things. Yeah, finally on your way, good luck. Best things in the game that you can buy. It is not the best weapons in the game. Uh, or, or armor in the game, but best stuff you can buy. You can buy uh, gauntlets. I will require two of those. I thought I was near max money. I was not. Um, there was one more digit that fit there. Uh, so the game is not think I'm completely overpowered just yet. I do need two more gauntlets. I need uh, three vest guards as well. The gauntlets we have seen, they give you 90 uh, defense. The vest guards, uh, they will give you uh, 240 uh, total defense. Just ridiculous numbers here. Uh, we also need a needle helm. You need three of those. Those will give you 140 defense. So significant upgrades here. And I am still not even close to, to full. Uh, well, close to low on money. We do have a new item here. A barrel. Barrels are very nice. Barrel. Barrels will make you invisible for a short amount of time. You can attack. I believe if you try to attack, it will... Um, it will just cancel out the barrel. We're going to fill up on those. You can only have four, unfortunately. So I'm going to be back after I equip all that stuff, sell what I don't need anymore, and I'll probably be up to, you know, like 8 million or 9 million. Whatever, whatever, I, whatever I'm at now, I'll be up to 8 or 9 instead of 6. All right, didn't get as much money as I thought. About 760,000. I'm still on hundreds. Of thousands, by the way. Uh, there is a little bit more that we can do here. I'm still looking for a couple people. Uh, not just one person, in fact, but a couple. But they're not here yet. Uh, can I talk to you again? Do you have anything new to say? No. It's, no, no one's been there. Beware! It is forbidden. It is taboo. But if we go inside, there are people hanging out here. Yeah, the Emperor was betrayed. Oh, my heart is broken. Uh, ever has been stopped, but the world's finished. Oh no! Here we can find Fana! 
because we totally remember Fana. I said some awful things, Xi'an. Forget it. You weren't yourself. I guess I was jealous of you two. Thanatos noticed and used it to his advantage. Fana, look at me. Friends, okay? You're not even looking at her, Xi'an. You're looking off into the distance, kind of with your whip. And yeah, I have to hit X during those blank screens. Can't move. Oh, she has more to say. Xion, thanks. Hope you see Dylux soon. Yeah, me too. Uh, in case you were wondering, you can actually go back up to that mana seed up here. But it doesn't look like anything's going to happen here. Nothing's happening. Can I switch to the sword and do anything? Maybe that's the problem? I don't think I need to be on the sword before, but... In fact, I probably should be on the sword for now. We'll, we'll stick with the sword. But yeah, the, no, that's not the problem. That is not the problem. Uh, so in fact, we are still at mana power zero. There's still one more person I'm looking for here. And for some reason, she didn't spawn. Hopefully she spawned this time. There she is. It's Chrissy. It, should you want, um, you, can, you can heal here. Just HP, though. Uh, so you still need to go back to Matango, at least I, I feel like you need to. Uh, you might be fine without it. Uh, but we still have our next destination in mind. We were told we needed to go to Mana Forest, which is pretty much the last place on the map that we have not been, as far as I remember. Uh, yeah, I think it's the last place. Um, we need to go southeast in order to get there. It's a pretty short journey. We've been there. Hundred, we've flown over it every time you need to go here. Uh, you can just land right in the middle. And I've been waiting. Come here quick. And we do encounter new enemies here. We have a needle lion here. If he shows up. There he is. There he is. And once again, the game has decided, oh, you want to see your enemy? That's too bad. Uh, those things up there. Upgraded chicken feet. No, 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 no. Griffin hands. Totally different. Different anatomically and everything. We got Asobuko, not Steamship Round. Sorry, that's, that is culinary terms that nobody's going to understand. Let's head up here. Uh, there are pretty much two paths that you can go from here. Oh, great. Confusion. Oh, no. Uh, the two paths are north and uh, west. I think I like uh, north better, so we're going to head that way. Because it gives me an excuse to chop things with my sword. Can I poke? No, we have to jump and leap and attack. Uh, but you can go this way. Uh, at least to the same spot, though. Uh, nothing nothing that great along the way. Anyway, we do have more enemies this way. These are Mush Glooms. Because they're upgraded Mush Booms. And they are fairly easy. They do cast wall, though. Uh, here we got Ice Thugs instead of the Water Thugs. Because they're colder. And that totally makes sense. Why? I don't know. I mean, they're in a forest, and so the water. Th you think the water thugs would be colder? The ice thugs would be in the ice country, but no, no, they're in the forest. There we go. Get whacked. Uh, now we can start heading up here. We have a mush gloom over there to take care of, though. Looks like we did over 400 damage with that thing, but it still didn't kill it. Now we can head up here and see a giant tree stump. I don't believe that is where we are headed, but we should be fairly close to where we need to go. Kill the mush gloom! It needs to die! Down it goes. Is it... No. no. There is a definitely something on the screen that... I remember this screen being difficult, to be honest with you. I'm, like, I got stuck on here. And I hated that. I'm trying to remember where the actual solution was. I'm like, it wasn't... It, was, it wasn't obvious. It was kind of tricky. Uh, you can't go up the waterfall, so that's not the way. Are you still getting hit? Uh, the game can only... It has to go through its, like, little animation before it can decide that things get hit. Now... Ah, there it is! There is the cave that we are looking for. It kind of looks like a shadow over there, but it's definitely a hole. And that is the hole that we are looking for. So let's head through there. And it is boss time. We're up against where is it? up against something that uses petrify. But we it is 
a dragon worm. Um, it's basically an upgraded. What was that guy's name? Anyway, we need to use Thunderbolt on it. Uh, powered up. Uh, Great Viper. I think it was his name. Whoa! How? Jesus! Full screen went. And we did over 500 damage. We're not exactly chaining it, but yeah, 500 damage is 500 damage. Uh, you don't need to use this very often, though. Um, I'm going to spam it. But 500 damage is 500 damage. And we'll go for... Yeah, I should heal. MP, please! How much are you going to give me? Ah, six. That's not that great. But I, I should be fine. Yeah, we're doing four each time. The easiest way to take out bosses, unfortunately, chaining magic. It, it's kind of anticlimactic, I know, but that, this is how this is how you're supposed to do it. And one more, probably about one or two more, should be enough to take him out. Down he goes. I wasted for him. He. Oh well. Down he goes. God axes orb. No victory music though. No victory music, unfortunately. I don't know what the deal is with these mid-bosses lately, but they do not want to give me victory music. So, let's continue heading north. And we got more enemies. Uh, should you want, you can feel free to use the barrels if you had enough money, and if you've been doing any sort of uh, level grinding, you should have enough money, I would think, um, to buy the barrels. You can, you can use those, become invincible. They do cancel out if you attack, though, so just run through, don't attack. Um, of course, don't use that if you're trying to kill something, like a boss. But if you're just trying to run through, just uh, equip the barrels and run on through. It, it, it's perfectly fine. We do have more new enemies. These guys are... Um, what are these guys? I don't even remember. What are you? Ghosts. How creative. Go air blast. I don't know if that's going to do very good. No. No. Uh, shade maybe? I only cast it on one of them, but we'll see. We'll see. Any good? Any good? 69 damage. No. The answer to that would question would be no. So let's just get my MP back. Seriously? What are you guys even good for? <laughs> I'm trying to move on and they won't let me. Come on, down, down here. Down. Is it through? No, it's... I swore it was down there. <gasps> oh, God. No. You're going to make me kill them, aren't you? I bet they're weak to Lumina now that I think about it. Lumina. I don't like you losing... Using that, though, because it's so much MP. And she doesn't get it back. Yancey gets it back. Yeah, there we go. Still not enough for the victory. It's level 7. It's one of the most powerful magics that I have. And it's still not enough to one-shot regular enemies. Or two-shot them. Well, I have it spread, but still. If this doesn't kill them, I'm going to be very, very upset, game. Don't do this to me. You absolute dicks. You've got to be kidding me. Alright, um... God, is it through the middle or do I just need to cut these things? Uh, uh, uh... No. No. Uh, come on up here. <gasps> Where the hell is the exit here? Ah, uh, hold on. 